Step 30. Illustration of the directory structure used for command line processing of input data. Here you can see the directory structure used for command line processing of input data, folder metadata, dataset folders, set 2A, set 2B, set 2C, set logo, and batch files, process and process data set. The folder metadata contains an XMP subfolder with XMP metadata files, and all other necessary metadata files with a reconstruction region, and model export parameters. Each dataset folder contains subfolders input, project, result, and temp. The input folder contains subfolders normal and projection. The folder normal contains source images for texturing. The folder projection contains source images for model reconstruction. The folder project is empty at the beginning. Reality capture projects will be saved there. The folder result is also empty at the beginning. Exported models will be saved there. The temp folder is used as the application source folder for images and XMP files. The currently required images and XMP files are copied there. Step 31 Illustration of bad scripts used for command line processing of input data. Here you can see the batch script process.bat which processes all input datasets calling script process dataset.bat with a name of each dataset as an input parameter. At the beginning of the process dataset bat script, the paths are set to application reality capture, to the application cache, and to a work folder with our directory structure. Here are set paths to folders with images, and XMP files, file names of reconstruction region metadata, model export parameters, and a variable storing a target number of triangles for the simplification process. In the next part of the script, the application cache is cleared and the currently required images and XMP files are copied. Then Reality Capture loads images, aligns them, imports a reconstruction region, calculates a model in the normal quality, simplifies the model to 1 million triangles, saves the project and quits. In the final part of the script, the application cache is cleared again, and the required images are copied afterwards. Then Reality Capture loads the recently saved project, calculates the texture, exports the model into the object file format, saves project and quits. Step 32 Hint, how to get model export parameters for the model export command. Here is a small hint how to get model export parameters from the metadata folder. When you export a model into the object file format using Reality Capture, the application creates also the RC info file. You only need to copy a selected part of this file. And paste it into an empty XML file. Step 33 Comparison of four models using Mesh Lab. Models of four available datasets achieved by using command line processing. Open all four exported models in Mesh Lab. Click through models to compare them. All models, created using exported data, correspond to each other. 